I guess my favorite smoothie flavor would be strawberry. Something with strawberry. I love strawberry. I've been struggling with these guys for like weeks and even months before playing on a stage and uh, there wasn't that much pressure. Like I was competing with Bunny and Bunny was already the like starting support. So the pressure was on, less on me. I think it was just a pretty easy process. I guess Mary Sneaky for that nice Twitch money. Kiss Jensen, cause you know, it's Jens Jensen. And Kill Reaper, cause he makes me play Braum on stage. So, you know, kinda sucks. Before I was a pro, I was around plat one, I think. And I started off as an ADC main, uh, but all my supports were really, really bad. Like every time I got a Thresh player in my games, I just wanted to like run it down. So I thought I could do it better. And I just started playing support from there. And uh, yeah, it ended up being pretty good. If you can teleport around the world or teleport to like different places, like pretty close by, it's pretty convenient. So I think I do teleport. I think I'm the biggest weep right now on the team. I think the second closest would be probably Sneaky. Yeah, I guess it's me, I guess. During my break, I watched a lot of uh, My Hero Academia and Haikyuu. Those two are probably my favorites. I don't think anyone actually plays Blitzcrank anymore because the meta's all tank supports, but I'm a really big fan of Blitzcrank. I played him so much and I, I'm just really good at it, so. I'd probably say Sven's Garen because, like, look at those muscles. You, 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 can't, you can't say no to those muscles. <laughs> So I've dyed my hair twice in the past year, I think. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna dye it again for a while. Maybe if I am, maybe something more subtle, like brown, or maybe just even go back to black, but uh, I don't know. Just like to try some new stuff. I guess Wendy's Frosties with their french fries. I don't know why it was so good, but it's a pretty good combination. I like it a lot. The memeiest person would 100% be Sneaky. I mean, he's always known for his memes and uh, he's a pretty funny guy, so I guess just Sneaky. Stick with a couple champions and uh, get good at those champions. Don't like, spam too much and don't try not to type in solo queue. I know it's hard when your team is trolling or they're really bad sometimes, but if you don't type, then like people get less tilted and it's just a uh, overall better plan. Oh, actually, this is one fan who, he took a picture of my palms to see like, I guess, I don't know what these are called, but like just see my palms and that was kind of weird, but whatever, I, I do it for the fans. The last movie I saw was Thor. Uh, it was really good. I actually was surprised. I heard really good reviews about it, but whenever I go to see the Thor movies, it's usually pretty bad. So I've never played Dungeons and Dragons before, but I think if I were to choose, I'd pick something on the lines of Rogue or Assassin. That's what I usually default to when I play new games, and they just, I don't know, they're pretty fun. They just dash over, dash everywhere and do lots of damage, so it's pretty pretty good time. I guess when I'm playing behind, the biggest thing you gotta what you think about it is not being like too panicked. Like you're behind a couple thousand gold, it's fine. I guess if I was gonna be a champion IRL, I'd choose TF. I think it's pretty cool that he can just teleport anywhere around the world. And I don't know, he's pretty smooth ladies too. So that's a pretty good, pretty good uh, second part. I think winning worlds is like a once in a lifetime thing. I mean, finding the girl of your dreams could be argued as a once in a lifetime thing too, but I th think for what I want to do and my ambition, I think winning worlds is just better for me. I don't know, I, I like swords a lot. So like something along the lines of sort of online characters. Uh, those are pretty cool. Like a skin, maybe a skin for Fiora. Um, I don't know who else uses swords in the game, but I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> oh, that'd be cool actually, that'd be cool too actually. <laughs>